got some money. But I do want to explore. <laughs> I do want to explore a little bit more, kind of. Kind of. Maybe. There are some of these stalls here that look interesting. With the balloons. No, they aren't stalls. Okay. Well, that makes sense. But this this start, side of town is all about um, dressing up, I guess. Probably. I can't. I can't see. Now I can see, kind of. But I might go off screen and check out some of these stores, maybe. This one's obviously a hat shop. And let's see, that's a glasses store, shoe shop. Uh, another shoe shop? I think. What? Or is that a socks shop? Okay. <laughs> that's very, very specific. I would have thought, but I don't know. Uh, and this is just general clothing? Or something? Rough and tough. Yeah, it's got a few different things here. It's got gloves, but it's also got uh, hats and glasses of different kinds than probably the other shops, maybe? I don't know. That's all there. Gonna come back to some of these later on. And what is this? This. Is this a... Chancy Supply. What can we assist you with today? Just a random supply shop. For doing different amounts of healing stuff. Revival Herb. Also fully restores the Pokemon's max HP. That's actually crazy. Heal Powder. Can be used to cure any status, con status condition a Pokemon may have. So yeah, there's some good stuff here. And that's only 300 Poke Dollars. Uh, energy root can be used to restore 120 HP. And energy powder uh, restores 60 HP. Also have all of these other stats here we can increase. But I think we've already seen those before anyway, so... I'm good, thanks. Ah, uh, don't go back in. It's so hard to know where I'm supposed to be going when the camera changes. Saying hot stuff. Some of these stores I'm pretty sure I've seen before. This place is very nice though. I think I've been in the blue stores, probably. Probably. Also, maybe some of the shops also have other things in them as well, possibly. Maybe. I wish I could keep moving while the map was up. Kind of. Have a half map or something. But I'm just going to go basically to the Pokemon Center and then probably just not explore that much more than that. Just take a look at these other things maybe. Is this a gift shop of some kind? Nope, this is not a shop at all. I thought it was, I thought I was entering a cutscene, but no. Another Chansey place. Some kind of supply shop. I don't know. I don't know. It's fine. It's hard to actually tell what some of these shops are, somewhat. But anyway, let's register this, uh, Pokemon Center. I like the design of these new Pokemon Centers as well. Just having both sides available, and it's all open, not actually inside of a building. It's very cool. And I just remembered- oh, my Terra Orb is also healed- restored. Profile app, if you select the profile from- uh, the map app, you can find various records from your adventure. You can also check your profile picture and trainer icon. Both your profile picture and your trainer icon can be updated freely by taking photos with the camera app. Enjoy crafting a profile that's all, all your own. Well, there we go. So that's registered now. I don't think there's anything else to find. But also I need to also switch my team around because that's what that was reminding me of. What is this? Give a churro and sm smoochoro. Come on, have a bite. It's just a food shop? Yeah. Okay. Nope, stop. Stop crouching. It's fine. I think some of these areas aren't necessary. And I, I don't know if people are actually going to give me anything. Or if I, I don't know. I don't know how different this is to other Pokemon games. 
so far, but it seems very different from the ones that I'm used to. So I might just leave it. Leave a lot of this other exploration stuff. No, I don't need this. Goodbye. So I'll, I'll head to the, the stairs now. The stairs of death. Because of how tall they are. There's so much area. Like, what's down there? I mean, probably not much. Not much that I haven't seen already. Because things keep reappearing. I've already seen stuff in multiple locations, so I don't need to see it more. Well, there's a lot of stairs. We haven't even made it to the full stairs yet. Oh, this is a lot of work. It looks like a park in the background there. That looks cool. Oh, this music is worth the climb. Very much so. This place looks epic. Let's go in. Here we are, Jeremy. Welcome to Naranja Academy. Finally, this here is the entrance hall. You can sign up for all kinds of classes at the desk behind me, and those halls off to the sides. Lead to all different parts of the school. It's totally big enough to let loose and battle in here, but for some reason they banned Pokemon battling in the main entrance. Master Jeremy, Miss Nimona. How did you find your first school commute? It was, I had, we had a blast. I imagine Miss Nimona's high spirits helped with that. She's a true asset to our fine academy. Not that I was expecting any less from our champion ranked student council president. Reliable as ever, Miss Nimona. Well, I know how to look after my friends, right Jeremy? Oh, but speaking of which, we saw some of those Team Star Kids in town, Director. You did? Where? It was down the stairs from the front gates. They were harassing this kid with an Eevee backpack. That is quite the news. Are they still to be found out there? Actually, Jeremy flexed on him and ran him off. You don't say. Of course, it's a fine thing to try and help a fellow student, Master Jeremy. But you might want wish to show a bit of res restraint as you find your feet here at our academy. And Miss Nimona, do remember that the school's staff is here to resolve any such troubles. Uh, right. Yes sir, Director. A child with an Eevee backpack, you say? I suppose that might have been Miss Penny. I'm relieved to hear she's come back, c come to class at least. Ah, and Miss Nimona, if you'd be so good to uh, do report to Mr. Jack about, th th uh, about this Team Star business. As your homeroom teacher, he should be he be kept appraised of of all such go goings on. You got it, sir. Ah, but look at the time. You two had better hurry along. Classes will be starting soon. We're in class one A, Jeremy. Come on, I'll show you the way. Cat Jam. Good morning, Mr. Jack. Jack, Jack, I don't know. Hello, hello everyone. We have some exciting news this morning. Who wants to hear it? Oh, me. I want to hear the news. I suppose I should have told you sooner, but we have a new little friend joining our happy homeroom as of today. Whisper, 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 whisper. I wonder what they'll be like. Alright, you can come on in. Could I trouble you for a few words, introducing yourself? Sure, I'm Jeremy. Did you hear that? He sounds super friendly and fun. Looks like everyone's eager to get to know you, Jeremy. 
Alright then, who wants to be the first to ask a new friend a question? Me, me, can I ask a question? What's your favorite thing about Pokemon? Uh, everything about Pokemon. Really? Awesome, I'm totally the same. Does anyone else have a question on the, for their new classmate? Me, I have a question. You went all to all the trouble of enrolling here, so spill, Jeremy. What do you hope to get out of it? You must have some kind of dream, right? Uh, the, uh, uh, probably can't, why isn't there all the above? Anyway, <laughs> want to become a strong trainer, eventually. You will be. Oh, I just know it. You and me. We're gonna get strong battling together. Well, thank you for telling us a bit about yourself, Jeremy. I'm Mr. Jack. Jack? Ah, oh, I really don't know. I teach biology here at the academy. I'm also your homeroom teacher. That's your seat, second row from the front. Alright, you ragamuffins. Be nice and friendly to our new classmate. We will, Mr. Jack. Jack? I do, I re It's got a cue at the end, why? <laughs> Get to know the Academy campus by exploring a bit on your own. That's a dangerous uh, com uh, uh, combination of things. Uh, math class is available to take. Battle class is available to take. And something else was available to take, but it went away. I think if I tap uh, right. Nope, no new notices. Cool. Good to know. Yo, new kid. Glad to have you. Well, what? You want to talk to me? Welcome to the academy. The class is in session. We need we t uh, when class is in session, we tend to be on our best behavior, but our best is still isn't that good. Thanks for answering my question earlier. Looking for Nimona? She got called to the staff room just now. This is a weird camera angle. Like, I understand kind of why it is like this, because there's no wall here, but still. It's, it, it feels a bit weird after being out and about. Now choose a clo location, location start exploring. Uh, I guess I'll check the cafeteria. There's a lot here. All at once. It's very different from actually doing Pokemon stuff. Oh, hello. Oh, hey. So we meet again. You remember me, right? I could be so rude right now. Oh, from the lighthouse. Yeah, exactly. That's my little know-it-all buddy. Got a mind like a steel trap, eh? No need to tell me your name. Jeremy, right? Whole school seems to be talking about you. The new kid who showed up with the... President of the Student Council. I normally wouldn't even bother showing up for class, but I came all the way to school today. Just to talk with you, our new celebrity. You've got to help me so out so I can finally make my dream a reality. Uh, happy to help. What kind of little ma maniac says yes to something without even knowing what they're uh, uh, agreeing to? I mean, I can help whatever, however I can, and that's what I was going for. But I, I, I don't know if I would... I don't know. Anyway. Well, this might come as a surprise. But fact is, I'm all about the picnic life. The great outdoors. The perfectly prepared sandwiches of all of it. Not half bad at cooking either. I can tell you. And right now I'm researching new recipes that'll help... Pokemon feel better. Real health food, see? I found this book the other day, see? And it had a section about these Her Herba Mysteria things, see? I'm making fun of him saying see at the end of it, and, and I'm going to continue to do so. Basically, there's some kind of special herb, herbs that heal up any Pokemon as soon as he it, it, it eats them, see? Now, there are a total of five different types of Herba Mysteria. Based on what I read. Just taking a little lick of them. Uh, once they've been powder powdered, we'll get your blood flowing. flowing. Provide nutrients. Prevent aging. It'll even boost the immune system. 
These herbs seem like they're the real deal, only found here in Paldia, and rare to boot. But this book says they're all guarded by Titan Pokemon, meaning that it's going to be pretty tough to try and grab even a few sprigs. Because see, Titans are, well, I think they're going to be things like this. Monsters of Area Zero. As we descended further into Area Zero, we get, began to catch glimpses of mysterious Pokemon. Though we wondered if these huge ferocious beasts were indeed Pokemon at all. One of our team suffered a brutal blow from such a beast and was mortally wounded, forcing us to retreat for a time. A member of the survey team captured this photograph. By chance, I noticed a passing resemblance to the Pokemon known, known as Donphan. Yet differences such as its sheer size and, and the shape of its back set it apart. As do its great tusks. I really want to get those herbs for myself, but I'm not very good at Pokemon battles. Don't have any friends with strong Pokemon to lend me a hand either. And I'd never hear the end of it if I went crawling to that student council girl. But here you waltz up. You've got you've got to help me out with this. You'd be perfect. Sure. Nope, wait. I don't need an answer yet. I'll just re register the places where it seems there might be Titans on your in in your map app for you. Okay. That's a few places. See the different types that they are. So there's rock, ground, flying, steel, and dragon. It also is. I I just realized there's the different lighthouses on different parts of the world. That's cool. The Titans flares have been added to your map app. Path of Legends. Quest unlocked. I assume, I don't know. Let it stew a bit, and we can get more into the details later. And in the meantime, take this. A little gift for listening and all. Bag of Stardust. Treasures, treasures pocket. Stardust is just a selling item, I believe. So we can sell it for some money, if we need it. Give the idea some serious thought, please. Okay. There's some combi here. They're pretty cool. But I think that's everything I need to do in here, probably. There's a lot of people to talk to. Rotototototo. That's kind of cool. The Rotom phone speaks in Rotom. This is Jeremy, correct? I hacked your smartphone so I could talk to you. Hope you don't mind. Uh, I'm sorry, who are you? My name is Caso... Pia, Pia. Cas Casopia? But never mind that. It's you I want to talk about. I hear you're a trainer with serious potential. If that description is accurate, there's something I'd like to ask of you. Tell me, Jeremy. What do you know about Team Star? Right? You, or you know about Team Star, right? Yeah? Great, I appreciate you being up front here. Team Star is a group of troublemakers formed by some academy students a while back. They are headaches for the school and try to bring other students down to their level. And I refuse to sit idly by and let them get away with it. So I've come up with a plan to bring down Team Star and force them to disband for good. I call it Operation Starfall. But I'll need allies to carry out this operation. And I'd like you to become be to be one of them. Sure. No, no need to reply the, uh, right this second. We can discuss the detail with some some other. <laughs> Start again. We can discuss the details some other time. Till then, I'll leave you to it. Bye. Ah, Master Jeremy. Please do try, uh, try to keep your voice down if you're making calls within the school, won't you? Of course, sir. 
You don't want anyone else overhearing any personal information after all. Honestly, there are so many things we need to be careful about in this day and age. On you go, then, young man. Why do I feel like it's you who was just calling me? Team Star, you say? No, maybe not. Okay, but that's sus. In some kind of way. Okay, now how do I move around some more? There's so much places. Can I possibly check the floors? Yeah, I can check where I want to go from here. Cool. Interested in any classes? Good morning, Master Jury. What class would you like to take? Um, I could take classes. Biology? You'd like to take biology with Mr. Jack? Jack? I assume it's just Jack. Class will begin soon. Don't be tardy. Hello, hello. My name's Jack, and I'll be your bo Pokemon biology teacher. In my class, we'll all learn about the ver ver various quirks of our beloved Pokemon together. I hope you come to love all... Love to... Hope you all come to love Pokemon even more from the things you learn here. In today's class, I'll teach you a great way to get to know Pokemon in more depth. If you'd like to become better friends with your Pokemon, you can let them come out of their Pokeball and walk along with you. Sounds great, huh? You can use the ZR button to throw a Pokeball and let it out and let out the Pokemon inside. Nothing cuter than watching your Pokemon run around bit underfoot, if you ask me. Once you let your Pokemon out, try speaking to them. They're sure to respond in some way. It's a, a great way to get to know them better. However, letting your Pokemon out of its ball isn't such a great idea in some locations. Can anyone tell me where uh, it is that you shouldn't have your Pokemon walk along with you? Uh, in tall grass. No problem there, okay. The correct answer is they should not walk We'll walk our Pokemon indoors. How about that? Some Pokemon might damage walls, desks, and other things walking around inside buildings, so it's not allowed regardless of the species. Therefore, please only let your Pokemon out of their Pokeballs while outdoors, okay everyone? I think I see them out and about in classrooms from time to time, but still. Anyway, you may become even closer friends with your Pokemon pals by walking together. Oh, I almost forgot. Keep in mind that you can o only walk together with your lead Pokemon. Remember, use the ZR button to throw a, uh, throw a ball and let out the Pokemon inside. You'll also want to remember that throwing a ball at a wild Pokemon will start a battle. Looks like that's all the time we have for today. See you next class. My throat is starting to die. I mean, it's been starting to die for a little bit, but... In combination with everything else, I'm dying. Let's try another class. Oh, we can actually take more classes? There's, there's like, Biology 2. I might come back to that at a better time. Let's go to the staff room. Very well, Champion Nimona. I trust you to handle this in my, sta in my stead. Sure thing, you can count on me. In fact, I bet this is going to be fun. I'm glad to hear it. Good day then. Oh, pardon me. Oh, Jeremy, hey! What was that? She piqued your interest, huh? That lady is, well, they call her La Pri 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 Primia. She's strong. She can do pretty much anything. She's got a uh, cool practically coming out of her ears. She's basically everything I want to be. Or that any 
Pokemon trainer would want to be. Really? Oh, which reminds me. Remember that homeroom when I asked what your dream is? Well, since your heart's already set on becoming a really strong trainer, I've got an idea for you. You try to reach champions, champion rank, like me. Yeah, I will. Oh wow, hang on, though. I've got a whole spiel I want to give you. Here goes. The trainers who reach champion's rank are the ones who raise their Pokemon really strong. They're pro-tier battlers. Their moves keep crowds absolutely on the edge of their seats. You have to prove yourself to the Pokemon League to officially get the cha title of champion. And to do that, you have to do more than just take classes here. You've got to take on 8 Pokemon Gyms and win so you can collect their Gym Badges. Once you've done all that, all that's left is a special test, the Champion Assessment. And once you pass that, then at long last you'll be a champion. It's every Pokemon Trainer's dream, the coolest title anyone could ever hope to get. Not to brag or anything. I reached Champion's rank during our last treasure hunt, you know. Oh, the treasure hunt is a special independent study thing we, we've got here. Should happen soon. Our last one started not long after the beginning of the school year. It's great! You get to leave school and to go have an adventure and learn however you want. I guess you could say my journey is to becoming a champion was the treasure I found. Maybe? I don't know yet if that's the answer I'm looking for. Anyway, I've got a feeling I'd like I'd be able to get even stronger if you and I were both working at it. Let me go ahead and save the, the gym's locations in your map app in case you decide to go for it. So there they all are. There's grass, electric, ice, ghost. Normal, water, and bug, and psychic. Gym locations have been added to your map app. Victory Road. So we have a couple of main goals now to, to aim for. Give it some thought. Calling Master Jeremy to the director's office, please. Uh oh, I'm in trouble. Once again, Master Jeremy to the director's office, please. Well, I, I didn't do it. It was, it was... The other ones maybe do it. I don't know. Director's office. So we can go to. Thank you for coming, Master Jeremy. Have you been enjoying your time here at uh, Naranjur Academy? Yes. That is most wonderful to hear. Now, you may be wondering why we could not have simply conversed earlier in the cafeteria. But let me assure you, there is a reason why I asked you uh, to meet me here. It seems that a friend of mine has a rather serious matter that uh, they would like to discuss with you. Ah, uh, no. I'm afraid they ha aren't actually here in this room with us. One moment, please. Just allow me to connect, connect us. Hello, Jeremy. It's nice to meet you. My name is Professor Setter. I carry out Pokemon research within the Great Crater of Paldea. At a site known as Area Zero. The professor is, in fact, a, grad a graduate of our fine academy, as well as a splendid researcher. 
Well, allow me to get this get straight to the point. Jeremy, student ID number 805C393. You are the student who travels with the usual uh, Pokemon. Coridon, is that correct? Yes. Thank you, I appreciate that you are honest in confirming the facts. Uh, not that I... I do not mean to offend you. In fact, I wish to ask for your assistance. With what? Oh, how good to see that you are well. It has been quite a while since we last met. Coridon was once in my care, you see. Its Pokeball was originally originally mine. I assume you received it from a young man called Arvin. I am no longer in any position to be able to manage that Pokemon myself. This is what I would ask of you. Will you continue looking after Coridon on my behalf? Sure. I do appreciate your agreement. Coridon has been greatly weakened and is currently incapable of battle. It can, however, take on a form specialized for mobility. In all likelihood, it will require some time to fully regain its the capabilities it once had. I will provide you with my contact information, if you would please get out your phone. I will be in regular contact going forward to keep tabs on your status. Until then. Could this Pokemon have its origins within Area Zero? Sada, don't tell me you actually did it. Well, it seems that the professor is asking quite the favor of you. But of course, the Academy is always here to support you in any way that we are able. I do hope you'll continue to enjoy us, your school life, together, together with that Coridon. Well, there we go. We have several things to focus on, I guess. Also, hello. Look at all those Pokeballs. Hello, excuse me. Oh, you're still here, Jeremy. Oof, getting called into the director's office. How'd you land in that much trouble already? Nah, kidding. I know it wasn't like that. Mr. Jack wanted me to show you the way to your room in the school dorms. Your very own private room. Jeremy, let's go. Check it out. ta ta cha ta Ah, hang on. ta 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 -chan. From today on, this is your room, Jeremy. Actually, it's as new to me as it is to you. Never been in here before. Maybe check out your new bed. It looks comfy, and you must be pretty worn out from all this. Stuff happening on your very first day, huh? A quick rest on a bed is all you need to get yourself and your Pokemon healthy again. I'll see you tomorrow, when you've rested up. Then we can battle even more. Take care. Well, there we go. That's the first day down, I guess. That's a lot of stuff all at once. Like, non-stop stuff all at once, basically. Since we entered the city. So anyway, that is it for now. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.